Hi, my name's Trey Fudgings, and this is how to create a drum sound patch for your Roland Axe Edge Part 1. Make sure Bluetooth is turned on on your Axe Edge. Open the Axe Edge editor and tap Setup. Tap BT Devices and tap Axe Edge. Now tap the back icon on your device. Make sure the input and output are set to Axe Edge. If not, tap the down arrow and select the Axe Edge from the list. Tap on the Editor tab. Tap on the Switch tab. In the keyboard switch section, turn off part 2 and 3. With the sound tab highlighted red, tap part. With the part 1 tab highlighted red, tap list in the tone section. And select 1229TR808TOM from the drop down list. Now tap Edit in the Tone section. With the Common tab highlighted red, tap Category and select 46 Drums. Near the top right of the screen, tap the right arrow. With the OSC tab highlighted red and the Partial 1 tab highlighted red, Change wave number L to bass drum 559 synth kick 7 from the drop down list. Now tap the keyboard tab and set key range lower and key range upper to C3. Near the top left of the screen, Tap the left arrow, then tap the Switch tab. In the Partial Switch section, turn on Partial 2, 3 and 4. Near the top right of the screen, tap the right arrow. Tap the OSC tab, then tap the Partial 2 tab. Change wave number L to snare 690-909-SN2B-P7 Set Gain to 0dB Then at the top of the screen tap the Keyboard tab and set Key Range Lower and Key Range Upper to D3 Next, tap the OSC tab, then tap the Partial Free tab, change wave number L to Crash Symbol 802 Rock Crash from the drop down list. Set Gain to 0dB. Then, at the top of the screen, tap the Keyboard tab. and set key range lower and key range upper to C sharp 4. Near the top right of the screen, tap the right arrow and tap the AMP tab. Scroll down the screen and set time 3 decay to around 500. Set time for release to around 600. And set level 3 sustain to 0. Near the top left of the screen, tap the left arrow. Tap the OSC tab. Then tap the partial 4 tab. Change wave number L 
to ride symbol 811 Rock RD Edge from the drop down list. Set gain to 0 dB. Then at the top of the screen, tap the keyboard tab and set key range lower and key range upper to E minor 4. Near the top right of the screen, tap the right arrow. With the AMP tab highlighted red, set time free decay to around 500. Set time for release to around 700. And set level 3 sustain to 0. At the top of the screen, tap TR808 Tom and rename the part My Drums 1. Then tap OK. Now, at the top right of the screen, tap right. Tap a user tone slot, then tap right. Next, at the top left of the screen, tap done. Now, with the sound tab highlighted red and the part tab highlighted red, set mono poly to poly. At the top of the screen, tap Disc Sync Lead 1 and rename the sound patch My Drums. Then tap OK. Finally, at the top right of the screen, tap Right. Select one of the Axe Edge patch sound slots and tap Right again to save the sound patch to your Axe Edge. If you've enjoyed this video, do give us the thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.